Hello, everybody. Dr. Rick Wallace dropping in on you. Uh, happy Monday. Um, I'm not going to be before you long, but I did want to encourage you to get off to a great start. I want to talk to you real briefly about the power of purpose. Before I do, a real quick reminder. We extended the deadline for enrolling in the Your Best Life 30-Day Challenge to noon today. You have to have your enrollment fee paid, uh, but you can definitely still get in. There are a few slots left. For those who don't know, there's a link actually to a short YouTube video that explains the entire challenge and all the benefits of enrolling in this 30-day challenge. You get four sessions with yours truly, a personally designed plan for what you're going to be doing in that 30 days to achieve a state that will allow you to move forward towards what you want to do, a free disc assessment, and uh, your, your name to be put into a lottery uh, to win a platinum package for working with me, uh, a, a package that is valued at $10,500 absolutely free that's 52 weeks 52 sessions of working with yours truly at the most intense one-on-one -on -one level that's still available uh it's a lottery and the beautiful thing is i'm only accepting 25 people total for this 30-day challenge because i'm going to be working with every last one of them per personally so the time my time is limited so i can only take on 25 people we had a lot of people call in and say they want to do it uh, but we didn't have everybody uh, pay the enrollment fee. You're not in the lottery until you pay the enrollment fee. You're not accepted into the course until you pay the enrollment fee. And so for those who haven't paid, your spot is actually still open. And so the enrollment is extended until noon today. I'm doing the drawing this evening at 5 p.m. live on Facebook so that uh, everybody can see and it's going to go out there. I'm excited about it, but if you want to know more about it, click the link, go to YouTube, check out, check it out. If you want to, uh, you want to enroll, you need to contact me immediately so that I can get your information. I can get you the invoice. You can pay it and get in. For $99.95, you're going to get four sessions. Each session is worth $350 a piece. You're going to get um, a personal plan. A personal plan is worth uh, four or five times that. You're going to get a free disc assessment. Again, something that's four or five times that. Plus, you're going to have your name entered into a lottery to win a platinum package. I want to work with 25 people to show you what's possible in just 30 days. No, it's not going to be magic. No, your whole life isn't going to turn upside down in 30 days, but you're going to have a distinctive change in how you think and how you behave that's going to point you in a direction and start to push you in that direction. And then you have the formula for changing the other things that you determine need to be changed in order to become the person you need to be. You don't want to miss this. Um, there are a bunch of people that are always contacting me and saying they want to work to me, work with me, but uh, it's a little price. It's a little out of their range. This is your chance to work with me at a rate you're probably never going to see again. And I'm doing that for the sole purposes. I want everyone to have an opportunity to. And if you really, really want to, this is that opportunity to. On that note, I'm going to get ready to get out, uh, get on to what I got to talk about. But click the, if you need more information before you make a decision, click the link. Go to YouTube. It'll tell you everything you need to know. and You can move from there. But noon today, Eastern, I mean, noon today, CST, Central Standard Time at noon. I'm cutting it off. I'm going to start getting everything ready for the lottery, and I'm going to do that at 5 p.m. So if you want just a chance at one out of 25 uh, to uh, get that platinum lottery, go for it. If you want to actually take on this 30-day challenge, which I would encourage everybody, they should be on some kind of way that you're growing every month. And uh, this challenge is actually something that I'm doing for me, and I decided to invite people along and show them how they can take on whatever thing they need to take on in their life that they know they need to change. I'm working on something on me that I know I need to change, and I want to invite you along for the ride. Now, real briefly, uh, Sonia Renee, I see you on that. As soon as I get up, tell you what you need to do is go to my inbox on Messenger and give me your email address. When you do that, I'm going to email you 
an invoice for the $99.95. Once you pay it, your name goes in the hat uh, for the lottery. Within 24 to 48 hours, you're going to receive a contact uh, email from me to set up uh, the initial interview. And then we're going to set up, we start March 1st, 30 straight days on this challenge. So we, all of this is going to happen this week. So just send me your, um, and I may already have it, but uh, just in case, send me your email address that you're going to be able to get an email to and check it and do what you need to do prior to noon today, and we'll get you set up. Uh, look forward to working with you. Okay, real, real briefly, I want to talk to you about the power of purpose. When I'm working with people, there are a couple of things that I'm looking for. I'm looking for a, a, a sincere and authentic desire to grow and change. Uh, you know, people will say anything because they're uncomfortable, but there's there's a difference from saying something because you're uncomfortable and you just really, you know, know you need to, but you're not there. And actually being at a place where you are committed to change because see, change is uncomfortable. Change is unfamiliar. Change takes you to places that you can't predict the outcome. See, when you're in your comfort zone, you pretty much know I get up every morning at the same time, I go to work at the same time, get off at the same time, do the same thing, even take the same route to work every day. I pretty much can predict how my life comes. I know what my check is going to be before I even open it. So everything is set up for me and I'm familiar with that. See, when you decide to change, you don't know how people are going to respond to the change. You don't know what the outcome is going to be in, in, in a social uh, reality. You don't know what the outcome is going to be in a number of other different ways. So what happens? You sit back and you don't want it, but you got to want change. The other thing I'm looking for is, are they aware of who they are? Are they aware of their purpose? And, and if that's not the case, that's where we're going to start. We're going to start, start with discovering oneself, self-awareness. Do you know who you are? Do you know why you're here? See, we talk about design. We talk about how we are built, but we don't talk about why we are built a certain way. See, we are built a certain way so that we can service our purpose. We have people who are extroverted, people who are introverted, people who are highly articulate, people who have the ability to connect and communicate in ways that other people can't. People who can literally communicate by way of singing, people who communicate through music, people who communicate through energy, people who are very powerfully uh, capable of communicating in very few words and enlightening, empowering, inspiring, and elevating. People who can sit up and figure out problems that other people can't figure out. Everybody has a gift. Everybody has something that's a part of their design, and you're literally built to do something specific. Most people, people aren't aware of the purpose. I, I tell people all the time, it's a lot of things you've been going through in life and you don't understand why you're going through them, going through them and why you've been through them because you don't know your purpose. When you when you become acquainted with your purpose, it will explain your pain. I mean, it may not lighten the pain, but it'll explain it. What does that mean? I mean, there are some things you've gone through because it's preparing you to operate in your purpose, but you didn't understand it because you weren't aware of your purpose. When you understand your purpose, it starts to explain. It starts to unleash. It starts to open up. You discover that thing, passion, that people have been talking about that you can never understand. When people say, it's a part of my passion or it's, it's what's driving me, and you can't understand it. Why? Because you're not acquainted with your purpose. You've been given a life by somebody else to live because they thought it was the best life for you, but it wasn't attached to your gift. It wasn't attached to your purpose. And so it doesn't have the same meaning. You do it and you may even be good at it, but there's something missing. And a lot of things in your life simply don't make sense. Why, why does it not make sense? Because it doesn't make sense because in order for everything to line up and have some sense of order and understanding in the midst of all the chaos, there has to be a purpose for what's going on. And when you don't understand your purpose, you feel lost sometimes. When you don't understand your purpose, you feel like you are falling in a free fall and you don't understand what's going on. You can't understand why you have to go through this, why this didn't happen, why that didn't happen. Something was preparing you. I used to wonder why is it that I never got to know my father. Then I realized that I would be working with young black men my entire life who didn't have a father in their lives. I had to be able to connect with them. It's one thing to read about it in a book. It's one thing to read about it in a classroom. It's one thing to read about all the studies and all the empirical evidence that I encounter on a regular basis and sit up and say, okay, this is what's happening in the mind of a young black male who hasn't had a true relationship with his father. It's an entirely different thing to say I've been there 
there. I understand. I know what you're going through. And then start to talk about some of the feelings that they're encountering and some of the thoughts that they're having and they can relate to it and they know where you're coming from. And all of a sudden the heart opens up. They start to trust you. You are now able to perform your purpose. You got to understand the, 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 the true purpose of adversity isn't to destroy, it's to strengthen and to prepare. Adversity activates faith. You haven't truly experienced or lived faith until you've met adversity. But when you meet adversity in, 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 in the moment, in the midst of an understanding of your purpose, nothing shakes you. It's not that it's not there. It's not that you don't see it. It's just that you're not shaken. Why? I don't become frenetic and unglued by life situations and circumstances because I've got a purpose. And my purpose tells me as long as I'm still breathing, I'm in the fight. And that as long as I'm still breathing, I'm having an impact. As long as I'm still moving forward, that absolutely nothing I encounter will destroy me. And if it doesn't destroy me, it makes me strong. You've got to get to a point where you understand your purpose. That's what I want to leave you with today. Like I said, I'm not going to be long. I wanted to leave you with that. You must understand your purpose. And on that note, I'm going to get out of here. As I always say, I'm going to live my life on full. Each and every day, I'm going to live my life on full. Each and every day, I'm going to give it everything I have so that when it's time for me to leave this place, I die on E. That should be the goal, to die on E, to leave nothing undone, nothing behind, nothing you could have done that's still sitting on the shelf waiting to be done when you leave this place. Live it full. Take your 86,400 seconds that you have in every day and maximize them. Use them to the fullest of your ability and leave it because when you leave you will have lived a life that will outlive you and that's the goal to leave a legacy that's my challenge to you leave a legacy live a life that outlives you and on that note i'm out of here you guys have an unbelievable day don't forget if you want to get in on that you have up until noon to enroll we have probably if we include the people who said they wanted to uh, do it but haven't paid the enrollment fee uh, roughly about eight to ten spots so we uh, encourage you to jump out there if you want to do it. Get it done. Uh, get it done now. I'm out of here. You guys have a great day.